Hi, I'm Ryan Higgins with Valhalla Boatworks. Today we're standing in the deck ring of the V46. As a customer-driven company, we're trying to accommodate several different areas and their fishing needs. Anywhere from the northeast, long canyon runs, to the Gulf Coast, live bait tuna fishing and marlin fishing, as well as the South Florida customer with their hardcore kite fishing needs. Standing here, you're gonna see the two 54-gallon transom live wells, really nice deep gutters for the pressurization of the wells. These wells are driven by the hooker seat chest, as well as the 4500 hooker variable speed pump. As an option, you can have additional pumps. One of our nice fishing features is our deck box capacities. In the cockpit, you're gonna find two 440 quart in-deck insulated fish boxes with dedicated macerator pump outs, as well as forward at the bow, a 540 quart insulated fish box with a separate macerator pump out. Each box has a dedicated macerator pump out you also have two side lockers in deck at 220 quarts. One of the important features when, when traveling on a center console is having a place to put all your rods. What's really nice about our V46 is molded in into the deck liner of the boat, we have two seven foot long rod lockers underneath the gunnels. They're gonna be lockable, so when you're traveling to the Bahamas or other locations, you know, we're capable of holding 50s, 30s, 20s, spinners, an assortment of tackle in that seven foot locker, being able to lock it and leave all your equipment on the boat. As you can see in this massive deck ring, rod holder locations are endless. Starting in the cockpit across our seating unit, we're gonna have eight rod holders across the back of the seating unit. On the back of the hardtop, we're going to have a rocket launcher also accommodating eight rod holders. Also, in, in our forward lounge seating, we're going to be able to accommodate somewhere upwards of 10 rod holders in the lounge seat. So I'm standing here in front of our second row aft facing mez seating module. Tackle storage was definitely well thought out in the seating unit. Across the back here, we're going to have a fold down rigging center. You know, you can lay out all your tackle across the back of this mez seat. You're gonna have 12 3700 series Plano boxes as well as a, a large tackle drawer center. On the sides, we're gonna have three tackle drawers on each side as well as up, up top another tackle cubby. For bait, bait storage, you're gonna have two lids here with insulated coolers that could be used as a drink box or as a bait cooler. You're also gonna find as an option that these boxes could be refrigerated as well. So for long range fishing, especially in the Northeast or maybe in the Gulf, comfort on the ride out is key. And that's one of the great features of the V46. You can see here on the second row aft facing med seating, you're gonna have forward three helm chairs with the second row, four helm chairs. So seven people comfortably, three to four people on the aft facing mez. I mean, this boat just offers a tremendous amount of great spots to sit for long, long range fishing. So here we are in front of our two-piece hardtop plugs for the V46. Just look at the sheer size of this hardtop. So some of the fishing options that we offer with our hardtop is teaser reels. For the trolling crowd, we offer the pancake style recessed teaser reels in the hardtop. But what's really unique, like the Viking yachts, we incorporated our molded in radar pod, as you can see in the top of the hardtop there. That allows us for a recessed teaser reel box up in the hardtop with the door, and that will accommodate two US-6 MyEPOC electric teaser reels. Some fine details in the hardtop. You can see we have a recess for the Gemlux Blue Water Series bases that are gonna accommodate 22-foot Gemlux outriggers, whether they're internally rigged fixed riggers or telescoping outriggers. Stay tuned as we continue to tell the story of the V46. For further information, check out our website at ValhallaBoatWorks.com backslash V46.